America's Secret Weapon Hellfire Missile Hellfire Missile It is also called as Ninja Bomb, the American developed it to strike without hurting innocent civilians. Story of the Hellfire Missile In December 2019 terrorist was on the loose in Syria, the US deployed a missile to kill him. The target was a car, the missile found it, it tore through its roof, three terrorists were killed almost instantly. But the car they were in didn't blow up because the missile didn't have their bomb inside. Instead, it has short blades on its head they come out once they detect the target. This is the Hellfire R9X missile better known as America's Ninja Bomb. For several years America has kept this weapon a secret. In the last three years, there have been just 11 confirmed cases, where this weapon was used. But with its latest missile strike in Afghanistan, America has sent a message. It doesn't want to hide this weapon anymore. What can Hellfire do? It was designed to kill targets with precision while avoiding civilian casualties. Just like sniper with a long range. The weapon is a drone, it uses GPS technology to travel to its targets. The end of the missile is equipped with six short blades that are designed to crash targets. The blades are released shortly before impact. The weapon is not handled by a soldier on a battlefield. The American force has a special team of drone operators. They can fire this missile anywhere and on anyone from within the border of the United States. So far they have sent these missiles to the conflict zone in Syria, Afghanistan, Libya, Somalia, and Yemen. The weapon has been used on high-value targets one of them was Abu al-Qar al-Masri the deputy leader of the al-Qaeda. He was killed in Syria back in 2017 using the same weapon. How the incident was happened? When al-Masri traveled in a car in northwest Syria, the weapon hunted him down and struck the vehicle's roof. Al-Masri died and the car was damaged. But the same level of precision was missing in Kabul. The drone was flown from the Persian Gulf to Kabul its target was ISIS terrorists who were apparently planning more attacks. Pictures from the scene of the strike showed two badly damaged vehicles inside a home. Eyewitness with message says that they saw a large blast that shook the entire neighborhood. America has a repetition for killing civilians through its drones while going after terrorists. How many of them were killed? The drone was flown from the Persian Gulf to Kabul its target was ISIS terrorists who were apparently planning more attacks. These strikes would have killed 910 to 2200 civilians, children 283 to 484, killed. Totally 8858 to 16901 people were killed. The new series of Hellfire missiles were supposed to put an end to that but it looks like they too are as total as any other weaponized drone. Thanks for watching. For more such content subscribe to Fully Defense and press bell icon.